and we find ourselves at one of the most iconic venues in world football, the Santiago Bernabeu here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former England defender, Lee Dixon. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Real Madrid facing Villarreal. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We should be in for a belter here with these two. As deep-lying playmakers go, Luka Modric has few that can match him. What do you expect to see from Modric? Well, he'll run the game, he really does. He wants to be on the ball. He wants to move players in front of him so he can find that lethal pass. Well, who was Santiago Bernabeu, you might be asking? He was involved at Real Madrid for a long time as a player, director of football, coach, manager, club president from 1911 until 1978. Yeah, the steep-sided stands here, I believe, create a unique atmosphere in European football. Absolutely brilliant. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois, the Belgian, will be in goal. Toni Kors plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Modric. Toni Kors. The Villarreal starting 11. Raul Albiol starts with Ramiro Funes Mori in central defence. Manu Trigueros plays alongside Ibora in the centre of midfield. And the main forward is Paco Alcácer. Hazard. Tony Kors. Benzema. He's gone for power lead, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. Space and time for the cross. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Casemiro. A sloppy pass. Alcacer. And now Gazola. Modric. Carvajal. Now Casemiro, Tony Kors, the ball with Luka Modric, here's Carvajal, Bale, teammates could potentially join in, trying his luck from long range, the goalkeepers have to be mindful that long shots like that can come in. Yeah, I always look at goalies and say, do your job, keep the ball out the net, good job he didn't let that one in. What? He's got to be annoyed with himself, given the position he was in, Lee. Well, yeah, they worked it really well, didn't they? He's got in a position to score and not really took advantage of that. Benzema. Now Casemiro. Casemiro, well he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Ruben Peña, now they've lost it. Bale, Tony Kors, Santi Cazorla, Moy Gomez. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Real Madrid are totally dominating possession, but I don't think the manager or the fans will be too happy with this performance. It's all been a little bit too slow, too pedestrian. They need to find another gear if they're going to go on and win this. This is Kroos. Modric. Aidan Azar. Couldn't hang on to it. 
He's got space. Crossing possibilities. And clears his lines. Modric. Azar. Benzema. The ball with Luka Modric. This is Sergio Ramos. Modric. Tony Kors. Modric. Here's Carvajal. Now Casemiro. This is Kors. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. Couldn't keep the ball. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. I think you've got to conclude Luka Modric has been quiet by the standards he sets for himself, Lee. Well, it's strange. He's almost a bystander at times. He never looked to get in the right positions. You can see he's certainly not picking the ball up in the right areas where he can do damage. He's a very important player for this team. Interesting second half to come. Kicked off by Villarreal. It's with Ramiro Funes Mori. Job done defensively by Marcelo. Read it superbly to take back possession. Bale. Relentless high pressing. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Moy Gomez. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. The ball with Luka Modric. And it might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Hazard. And he cuts inside. And off the crossbar with that effort. Rather unfortunate. Well, it's a decent effort. Sometimes you're taught by coaches to aim high over the goalkeeper. That time just hits the crossbar. with Luka Modric and that's an important intervention Manu Trigueros my oh, goodness he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team this is Kroos Azar on the ball Benzema Ruben Peña. Manu Trigueros. Moreno. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Illegal play and hence a free kick. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. And deep into the penalty area. Over the touchline for a throw in. Santi Gazzola has it. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Santi Gazzola. Can they get themselves in front here? Well, fortune didn't favour him. Off the post and out of play. Well, he's really unlucky. It was worth an effort, that's for sure. Well, that was the chance to take the lead and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Federico Valverde. In possession, Marcelo. 
And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Gerard Moreno. Marcelo lost it just then. Well, it's deadlock. Could be a mistake. Could be a moment of magic. Surely someone will take this game by the scruff of the neck. Trembley. An attack full of promise. Great opportunity. Well, body in the way. It's with Onguisa. And here's Gerard Moreno. On and on he goes. And space for the cross. Well, that's a moment the fans won't soon forget. Paco Alcacer! We wondered if a goal was forthcoming, but it has arrived now. Well, finally the deadlock has been broken. Not long to go now. How will that affect the opposition? Well, Derek, the cross is great, but just look how he attacks the space. Gives the defenders no chance. Great goal. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, the manager's showing signs of frustration. They need to improve if they're going to get something out of this game, Derek. Substitution for Real Madrid. The opening goal of the game, then. Well, these Real Madrid fans are demanding their team attack here. It's fair to say they haven't been at their best today, but you'd like to think they get another chance or two. And only two minutes remaining here. Using space on the opposite flank now. They've given it away. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Here's Ramos. Casemiro, Karim Benzema, and the referee says that is all for today. Well, he put in a really thorough performance tonight, Lee.